everybody back with a new episode of agents of shield last episode ward took out his family including his brother we found out he was not lying about the well and he went to whitehall and sky's father to team up even though there's a lot at play between those three um i was confused about the city being on earth uh but when i was editing it with um whitehall when he back when he was uh verner uh talking about the the legends of uh star, a star that fell and you know the the blue angels is the city the star that fell they made a city there um this episode is called Ye, Ye Who Enter Here. I mean, are we going to the city like already? That seems very soon. But I mean, the show moves so fast. And uh, I thought it was really interesting with the, uh, the translations of what um, is supposed to happen with the obelisk or something inside of it. And uh, Whitehall thinks it intends to conquer and uh sky's father thinks it means that it's going to end it uh it kind of reminds me spoilers for the movie arrival but how the aliens the translation was like either gift or weapon and that being such a, a huge difference it, it seems like it um the that something is lost in translation and they may both be wrong but Sky's father is looking for vengeance after uh, Whitehall brutally murdered Sky's mother. <laughs> I I'm also curious about um, what Ward's intention is with Sky's father. Like, I know how he feels about Sky, but like, when. Ward has talked about Sky's father. It's really been almost reverential or just like taking up for him. I don't know why. So maybe he is just trying to like work with her father in good faith, but I don't really know why he would feel that way. I don't know that Raina would have told him all of that. Uh, don't know, but I'm glad trip is okay he got shot but uh sky's father helped and uh had some words with colson colson did not tell sky that they talked uh, i hope that doesn't become an issue but i see if i see how it could be and then you know with bobby and hunter hooking up that'll make things awkward, but also, you know, there's kind of a question in the air of Bobby and maybe her past and I don't know. I don't know how it's going to go, but last episode I really, really enjoyed. Uh, so ye who enter here, uh, it, it sounds like the city, I would think, but, uh, yeah, I'm excited. I'm very excited to get back into it. So let's do it. <laughs> Sounds like a music box. What are you doing? So weird, right? <laughs> Sacrifices oh! have to be made. Poison tree, poison fruit. No. No, she's not poison fruit. Oh my God, you're her parents. Why is she saying this? Wait, wait, don't leave her. <gasps> No. Sky, wake up. That was quite the dream. Sorry I startled you. You okay? Yeah. <laughs> Lot to unpack there. Happy things. We're back. <laughs> and and so how'd you get it to fly? Oh, they're happy and smiling. What? Something wrong? Uh, storm's coming. Oh, well, it's fine. damn. You it's know. Never mind. Don't. No, 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 no. No, 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 no,
So if he's talking. Five, right. What you that? Okay, so I assume Sky knows. Talking about my dad. I'm sorry, okay, it must be so messed up. On our mission to Australia, we hacked a military satellite network. Using that, we ran a multi-spectral topographic scan of the Earth, miles deep through the oceanic crust. What about the obelisk? It's still dangerous all on its own. One crisis at a time. You're just gonna blow it up? We're helping her. How? How did you do that? Stay close. Stay close. Oh, vlogging technology, let's go! Sam, I'm on with the director. Thank you. You They're were saying triplets? the was there to kidnap Rain and not kill her? Well, there are triplets? Four two-man teams, all non-tactical, all in full surveillance mode. Senator Christian Ward, FBI sources claim that while the senator did leave a recorded confession, other evidence found at the scene suggests another party may have been involved. Uh-huh. He did We're all anxious to see the city, but I'd like you to run point on Raina's interrogation. I think she'll respond to you. Yes, sir. I'll spread the word. It's not the city I'm afraid of. It's her lunatic father. Keep an eye on her, okay? Of course. He's being I'm very asking. overprotective. How long were you two a thing? <laughs> a thing? Fix the night? No, I mean, we never. I, I never dreamed. Okay, I'm just gonna stop you right there. Dreams? This for an interrogation? All I wanted was my best friend back. Your best friend? I never thought Femme was anything else. That said, I can't imagine my life without him. See you there. Cute. Sir. Dad. <laughs> Mom and Dad. Your personal life, that's your business. I'm just wondering if it means you're bringing Hunter in on the other thing. That? No. The other thing? You lost heart thing you try to no, he has no idea. Oh. coordination on the show so good just want to make sure that we're here to destroy that weapon not recover it why would we do that that's what fury would do i'm not fury no but he did hand you the keys to the kingdom for a reason there are three million people on this island and i won't let hydra turn them into collateral damage he's a good guy with all due respect sir this kind of op fury would have a number a number unacceptable losses my number is zero, and for the record, I hate that phrase. Mm -hmm. That's why I brought Fitzsimmons. I'd rather use a scalpel than a shotgun. Yeah, it's Hydra. Might need the shotgun. Why do you think I brought you? Hey. There's Diego. He knows people. Right I'm so proud of Golson. Like, this show was such a good thing for him. I've been thinking, and I'm going to leave the lab so you can no. be the one who runs the science division. Oh no, that didn't, that didn't the snow, go the way it needed to go. The Dutch, the English, the Americans. When you hold it, these symbols appear. There's a point, like a sense of where the divider belongs. It sounds a little Harry Potter to me. Mm -hmm. It's alien technology. The diviner reads your DNA. You'll understand when you touch it. No oh, thanks, I'd rather not die just yet. You wouldn't. Yeah, you wouldn't. Not according to your father. He believes you're worthy too. I'm over here. I'm over here. Oh! <laughs> Holy shit! Get in. She did mention that they implanted a tracker in her. How fortunate. I'll get my best man on it right away. No. No, I was um I was just wondering how many of you are there anyway? Brothers, I mean. Thirteen. Thirteen. Thirteen! Very funny. You fell for it. <laughs> you know she still has my face. Mm -hmm. I heard. Lucky her. 
Any oh, that was a compliment. Raina claims that she can touch the obelisk without being harmed. This particular guard tower was built in 1634 and is well known as being haunted. Oh! The te tectonic stress. Tectonic stress. Oh, yes, uh, the structural. Structural integrity of the tunnels. See, you need each other. How, 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 how we know what the temple looks like? Uh, well, uh, we'll know it when we see it, I guess. Does he get emotional? Yes. <laughs> Violent, even. Yes. yes. But he's also quite misunderstood. I don't know about that. Then help me understand him. You're all he wants. Right. He wants you to Let's die with it. No. The ancients called them the Cree. Cree! <gasps> Change. That's why they left the diviner. The Cree? To die to the temple so the worthy would inherit the earth. And what happens to the people who aren't worthy? I hope they've said their goodbyes. That's Here, not cool, Reyna. Got it? Yes, sir. We have to warn Colson now. Something bad is about to happen. Ah! Damn it! Why isn't this working? We're getting some kind of interference. Uh. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Ah! not gonna let her get hurt, I don't think. <laughs> oh my god. This isn't an ice or these are real bullets. Shoot. Not to kill. Ah! Oh, he didn't know about that. He said it was a insurance policy. Ward let the plane go. <laughs> Ward's doing his own thing. His decision to make. <laughs> well, he made it. Fix it. You have a go. No. Shoot them down. Repeat. Shoot them down. Mag, no. I like him a lot. He better be okay, but I don't think he is. What happened to him? It overtook him. The Cree? I didn't think that they would touch on that. I don't know why. I guess because the MCU did it, but that was a lot later. And from what I can recall, it's been a while since I saw Captain Marvel, but uh, it's like the Cree were the bad guy in that. Or those ver those particular Cree and the scrolls were good, but I know in the comics it's usually the other way around, I think. So I, I really can't discern anything from knowing that it's the Cree, other than that's that they're here and that's cool. But oh my, Raina. Well, she helped and she didn't. I mean she helped, but she's still like all in on Sky's father. So she's definitely willing to go back with them. And uh, Ward just took Sky with them as an insurance policy. But uh, we know what he his real motivation is. 
Um, and he was supposed to shoot down the plane, which he did not, which, you know, I'm glad about. But also, they still plan on doing it, so they gotta, they gotta hurry up and figure something out. Oh, gosh. You know, I, I'm, not, I'm not gonna question Coulson's decision making, but, uh, I wish they weren't split up because things went bad for all of them. And, uh, we're kind of fucked right now. But hopefully we can track them. Maybe Sky can, you know, do something on her laptop that she took with her with the map on it or something. I don't know. But he's take Ward is taking her to her father. Ah! That's going to be something. If it actually happens, maybe they can intercept her back, but I don't know. They're they've got a lot to deal with with Mac and ah! Ah! I'm so, ah, no, please, let Mac be okay. But what do you do? And why did it do that to him? It is like he got possessed. He was worried and it happened. Ugh. So Fitz and Simmons talked, but it did not help anything. They kind of wanted to say their own thing and not necessarily listen to what the other person was saying. Uh... Simmons said that she's only considered him a best friend and it doesn't sound like that's changed. Um, but also it's not like she doesn't want him around. So him wanting to go to the garage is not great because we saw in this episode after that happened, like he needed some term and she knew it and only she would know it because you know they're science buds so they don't need to be separated but also there are more things to say like Fitz shouldn't punish her for not feeling the same way but it's understandable that he's hurt uh but they still need to verbalize a lot more things and they need to keep working together so they got to figure that out bobby and hunter are seem fine and happy but mac was like nah <laughs> storm is brewing there and we got a little insight of how her relationships go and they're back in it but you know there's loops and all that kind of stuff i'm sure the roller coaster is gonna keep on rolling so I, I don't see it, you know, <laughs> going well. I, I, th I think I agree with Mac about that storm. But a lot's happening, so it's not like they can really focus on their relationship right now. Uh, I was surprised that Coulson wanted to blow up the city. I, I thought he'd be more interested in what it is and what it means and what it potentially has to offer. But, you know, he's also concerned about where it is and the people around it. And he wants to keep them safe. That's his number one priority. I really like that speech that he had, the conversation that he had with, with Bobby. And I just really like, <laughs> I like what this show has done for Coulson's character. Obviously, in the MCU proper, he hasn't had a lot of time. Um, he's had some big moments and stuff, but this has really fleshed out his character in such a way where I just think he's great. And you really see the differences between what his priority is and Fury. Like Fury was always like willing to have sacrifices if need be. And Coulson doesn't even want to like entertain that idea. He's trying to save everyone. Um, so I, I like how they're differentiating them. And, uh, it's also interesting that he's like, I think it served a purpose to have Sky stay with Raina and have them have those conversations together. But also he was wanting to keep Sky away from her father, which seems like an inevitability that they are going to meet. And it might have been a good idea to take Sky with them to San Juan because maybe she could have done that and wouldn't have gotten possessed like Mac did. 
So, you know, maybe he is being protective of her in a way that it's kind of keeping her boxed in. But now she's on the way to see her father. I don't know. I, the, the conversation she had with Raina was a lot. I mean, she, I guess they don't consider themselves alien. But does that mean that Sky and Raina are Cree? Or chosen by the Cree? Special, uh, deemed special enough? I don't know. But, you know, Reyna is just bought into whatever Sky's father is selling because he, like, looked out for them. And uh, she says he's misunderstood. I don't know if I can go that far. She's like, well, yeah, he gets angry. But I'm like, well, he gets really angry. And uh, no telling what links he'll go to from, you know even more than what we've already seen. So I, I wouldn't go that far as Reyna, but I'm really curious to see if they're gonna like have an actual meeting and we're gonna see what that's like. <laughs> um, so yeah, this was uh, moving people around the map and uh, having those two teams separated really, uh, didn't pan out. I hate that Agent 33 is using her face. But it's kind of cool. They're doing like an effect on her voice and, you know, that big scar. So it kind of makes her look a little badass just because, you know, May's a badass. But, I mean, she could never be May. Um, Whitehall can try to have a May, but it's not going to work, buddy. And I wonder how he's going to react to knowing that Ward is kind of doing his own thing. Uh, I don't believe Ward has any allegiance to him. So I think this partnership is probably going to dissolve fairly quickly. But I also wonder when Sky's father is going to make his move to go after Whitehall. Because you know he wants to do it because of what Whitehall did to Sky's brother. So, Wow. Lots happening. Very, very, very worried about Mac. I don't want to lose him. I really like him. And, uh, you know, the relationship that he's built up with Fitz, I really, really liked. And we got moments here with Scott, uh, with uh, Bobby. And she is doing something that Hunter doesn't know about. But also, Mac knowing makes me think it's not some insidious thing. Like, she's not, like, working with Hydra. But it is something that she's keeping secret. So I want to know what that is. But uh, yeah, good episode. Excited for the next one. Is Sky going to meet her father? Are they going to be able to get her back? What is what is Ward going to do? Is Mac going to be okay? Oh my. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. I'll be back soon.